Hey everyone, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a cool saber effect for your text or whatever you want to put it on. The first thing you need to do is go on Google. You want to search saber after effects, go on videocopilot.net, find this plugin. It's called, uh, say just this one, saber. You want to scroll down, click download to Windows or Apple, whatever you're on. Just do all the steps from there. The next thing you want to do is make your text, whatever you want. Let's say, which is my name on every social media, basically. Let's send, put the text wherever you want it. Okay, now that you have your text centered wherever you want it, and you have it just exactly as you want it, you're gonna choose your font. We're gonna go with, we could go with this one maybe. Now that you have everything set up for this, you wanna go down here, you wanna click new and then solid, or you can go up in layer, new, then solid. We're just gonna call this one Saber, Saber. You want to just create it, make sure you have black background. Actually, it doesn't really matter for this. I just used the black background. Make sure it's at the very top right here. You then want to search for your effects and presets. You want to search for the Saber plugin you just installed. You want to drag it onto this uh, new solid we made. Now we have this just Saber, normal Saber line. We're going to go into Customize Core in the Effects Controls up here. If you don't have it uh, enabled, go into Window and then find Effect, con effect Controls right here. When you're in there, you're going to go to customize core, the core type, you want to put text layer on the text layer, select the layer. So we type Jacoon. Now you can kind of see it already. Next thing you want to do is go, on, go under render settings, then go to composite settings. You want to put it to tra transparent instead of black. There we go. Now we have this kind of too bright, weird kind of saber effect. You can either go to preset and select something like core, ghost. That's a lot to choose from, as you can see. Now that you have chosen your effect from something like uh, Ghostbuster, Neon, whatever you want to do, we're just going to do Ghostbuster, it looks cool. What you want to do to make the kind of uh, running in animation of it, like, you, like kind of evolving out, you want to go to the start of your effect right here on Saber. You just want to go on the customized core and you want to keyframe end size and offset. You want to put end size to something like 5 and end offset to something like 5 as well. Then you want to go around two seconds in. I like to do something like two seconds. Depends on how fast the music cinematics, whatever it is. You want to put it to something like 95 and 100. Now the text is there. Then you want to go to the end. Uh, well, not quite the end, but almost. And then you can select something like five and five again. Uh, actually, five not five and five zero and zero there we go so let's uh, watch it there we go you can of course also um you can of course also disable the, the that it's gonna get removed part so you can just have it like this and then it stays or whatever but yeah, that's basically it. Remember to also easy ease them just to make it look that tiny bit smoother. 